but in a strong, strong Ratchet. I mean, to be fair, Ratchet play is one of the few things that can actually get around Belmont. And it's like, a requirement to being a Roy mate. If you Along remain... If he can manage to remain <laughs> unpredictable in this set, I feel like he could find a lot of success. Phil has definitely had a couple of bets. <laughs> <laughs> He's definitely the hood's on. Yes, uh, Phil and I had a couple drinks before the tournament started. So, uh, you know, it'll be interesting to see how he plays. Phil, a constant advocate for how he plays better when he's had a couple of drinks. Yep. So, the classic power up. Yep, he's rocking the Guinness tag. Uh, we'll see just how well it works out for him. But right now, getting ledge guarded at dead. getting edge guarded at 60 and dying for I it. I mean, that's that's the way it is. If you can't get into that, you know, uh, forward air range to snap ledge, it's like, oh, guess I'll die. Yep, guess I'll die. I'm Belmont, right? Belmont off stage in a lot of trouble if he gets edge guarded, especially by a player who's as experienced as Ricky Clean is. You know. Ricky Clean been playing since what, Smash 4? Uh, end of Smash 4 maybe? I don't know. Yep. So, a player with a fair bit of experience, um, a fair bit of knowledge, oh, again, oh, like... <laughs> bit slow there, I feel like that could have killed. Mm. Well, to be fair, it's highly dependent on whether or not uh, Rick was SDIing. Yep. yep. And Ricky Clean, uh, not a player who's too foreign to the concept of SDI, so I wouldn't be surprised if he was. But you know, these are um, these are even percent. You know, uh, honestly, because Belmont maintains one advantage state, and you're gonna rack up percent like nobody's business. Yeah, and you know, will Roy, will the sword just wet noodle? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> exactly. You know, I haven't seen too much of uh, Roy players actually actively utilizing wet noodle hitboxes. It's because it's so, like, you don't know. Because it, it. because it purely is so terrible. Yeah, same like, with, like, Marth tippets. Mm. Well, like, that's the thing, like, Marth sour spots actually do combo into a few things when you know that you're going to hit a sour spot. But I feel like Roy players just don't... A, it's very hard to predict when you're going to sour spot. And B, it's very hard... Uh, it's like pointless trying to lab what you can get off a of South Bot. Labbing wet noodle tech? Yeah, like, what Roy player is going to sit there and go, yeah, I'm going to lab wet noodle? You know? That up he's doing work. Oh, and he's jumping That through. axe that catching axe. the air dodge. And this is so clear for Dionysus right now. Yeah, he's going to want to. Ricky's going to want to close out the stuff before he takes too much more damage. Exactly. Charge. But right now he's being, you know, ledge trapped by Belmont, which is the worst situation you could possibly be in. Yo, he re-grabbed the fire, so smart. Oh my yeah. god, he's mixing it. That's one thing you can always expect from Dionysus. He spends so much time in the lab that it's not at all surprising seeing him hit some crazy ass shit in bracket. <laughs> Be gone? Be gone! Yeah, no, um... Roy Neutral B has a disgusting lack of end lag. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all it right. risked it all. The Look, reverse edge guard. It would have ended the game if you got it. <laughs> but now it's actually winnable. It is. It is fairly even. <laughs> Roy, <laughs> Roy hits one on two advantage states and then F smash at 70 and Dionysus is dead. Yeah, Ricky, Ricky's struggling to get back to center stage. Yep. Oh, taking it back by four. But he's finding his opening. Getting caught by that up That up doing so much work. He's I've seen at least 12 hit. Yeah. It's it's a very good move for a Belmont to rely on. Oh, catching that roll. Going for the edge oh. guard. I yep, there's that fair. And that's game one, you going know. to Ricky clean. Mm. You get between Richter and the ledge, and the change just fails. He's clearly playing Simon. It, I I don't know. That's Simon? <laughs> what the frick? They're Look, they're both <laughs> Belmonts, but at the same what the time... What the frick? That's not Richter. Oh at the my same God. time, Dionysus is one of those people that will like throat punch you for getting them wrong. So, you know. But it was the key. Do they have a difference, or are they just pure echoes? Uh, okay. the The only difference between the two is that Richter's Holy Fire has water properties instead of fire properties. I see. I see. I see. So, uh, Olimar's blue Pikmin are immune to Richter's Holy Fire, okay. whereas Olimar's red Pikmin are immune to Simon's Holy Fire. Okay. That's the only difference. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay. That's it. Understandable. Um, but Ricky Clean showing a very good understanding of the matchup. 
like knowing that maintaining his advantage state is key. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Like, once you get in on Belmont, honestly, every time, and this is a quote from Dionysus, if Belmont's a disadvantage, they should die for it. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely 100%. But going, going to small battlefield instead of battlefield. Um, interesting pick coming out of Dionysus. I will update the scores. There we go. Uh, interesting that against a character like Roy, you want less space as opposed to more. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. I just it just means you can get in easier. Mm. And oh, there's a very interesting SD. Outplayed. Yeah. Mechanically outplayed. Mechanically <laughs> outplayed. <laughs> Mechonics. You ever have those moments where your mechanics are just better yeah. than the other person? Yeah. True. You know? They SD at twenty. <laughs> Oh, that that side B almost killing, but the return cross hitting Ricky clean. You know, Dionysus really wanting to maintain this, maintain this uh, advantage. But Ricky clean managing to really adapt and find his way around these Belmont ledge traps. Yeah, he's been good to get back from. Oh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay. This is sixty five percent, but a character like Roy against Belmont, this is very easily make yeah, upable. It's like two neutral interactions. Yeah. That one. Up the down air. Down air into Nair, not something you see too commonly from Belmont. No, but it worked. It does work. Oh, grabbing the bottle. Not doing too much with it. Dionysus kind of recklessly throwing out his projectiles right now. Yeah. Recklessly or skillfully? Uh, I mean, it's really skillfully. Se it really he seems like he's not respecting Roy's ability to close the gap. You know? Yeah. Like, if Ricky Clean can break through the gap, predicting what projectile he's going to use, then Dionysus' advantage state is just gone. Yes. But that is the classic Sony's dilemma. Yep, the zone of the limo. Although most oh, people, that was quick. most Belmont mains, oh, missing the tag. He didn't. Yeah. Most Belmont mains will argue that Belmont's more of a trapper than a zoner. Yeah, he do be trapping, but he traps the zone. <laughs> I don't know. He traps the zone. <laughs> oh, he's dead. He's oh, dead. No, he's had too much to drink. Thinking his fair <laughs> would grab the ledge, but not quite getting there. So that's a 2-0 coming out of Ricky Clean. Dionysus drinking a Red Bull, trying to uh, trying to sober himself up. I'm not sure yeah, if there's yeah Red Bull. Yeah, yeah, right, right. I'm not sure if yeah, there's a uh, not Red sure if there's Bull alcohol in Red. that Red Bull, but you know, there's something in that Red Bull, whether it be taurine or whether it be uh, guanine. Red Bull doesn't have guanine in it. Where's the insonitol? Oh my. God. But that's, uh, you know, you can click the lightning bolt and it reports scores quicker. I don't believe in lightning bolts. 